Welcome back to another YouTube video. This is the 500 subscriber special. Right now we're at Miami uh, Beach from Wish. Uh, it's exam time, but no one is studying. Everyone just photosynthesizing. Right now we're gonna go walk around, ask some questions, expose some people, make some friends, scout some talent. After we're gonna jump off the pier for the 500 sub special. Stick around, let's go. Gay son or thought daughter? Gay son. Thought daughter. <laughs> why Why thought daughter? Your daughter's gonna be a thought anyways, I'm sorry to tell you. Why, why uh, gay son? Because it's okay if he's gay. Gay son. Yeah. Gay son. Why, why gay son? I don't want to have to deal with the daughter's nonsense. I'm going to have to go with gay son on that one, you know. It's just, it's just disrespectful as a father and it, it would hurt me too much. You know what, honestly, I take the gay son. Just be like, really for the girls. Like I'd be able to raise him like for the girls. Gay son. Why gay son? Because I feel like I could educate them to respect women more than I could educate a thought daughter to respect herself. Alex, aka Marpussy, special guest, gay son or thought daughter? Uh, thought daughter, I could still hit. Gay son. Gay son. Why? No one wants a thought daughter. Yeah, no one wants a thought daughter. Gay son. Thought daughter. I think thought daughter. Why? Why thought daughter? Oh, uh, no comment. Both. Well, you want two want two children. I would love to have a gay son and a thought daughter. Which one's going to cause more trouble at the dinner table? Probably thought daughter. What is the most attractive muscle group on a guy? I want to say back. A nice, like, big, broad, like bulletproof back. Like lads. What's the most attractive muscle group on a guy? Scouting the talent. Abs? Yeah, shoulders. Like a nice... Back. Okay. A bulletproof back? Yeah. Back. Uh, arms? Back. Back, back and arms. Who are we here with today? Um, Lil Uzi Vert. And what program are you in? Uh, engineering. What's the most attractive muscle group on a guy? Uh, chest. Why, why chest? Like a nice big um, double D. Me personally, I like boobies. Ass over tits. I mean tits over ass, so, um, chest. Biggest red flag in a guy? Tight jeans. Oh, like yeah. Oh, yeah. tight, those, skinny, those, ripped. Those jeans that have like the ruffles and they're sagging. With like the jean flag. underneath. Yes. Yes. What's the biggest red flag in a guy? Um. Okay. This is more of an ick than it is a red flag, but I feel like when a yeah, ick's fine too. When a ping pong drops on the ball, like on the floor when you're playing pong, and they kick it while they're chasing it, and they have to keep ch kicking it while they're picking it up, I'm just like watching them like fall or like mess up just like trip over stuff like tripping is like like ping pong ball like falling yeah, down like, like reaching for the ball <laughs> oh if they wear flip-flops even like in a beach setting like flip-flop what about crocs is that like cool <laughs> crocs are okay um when they just are dirty if he's insecure if if he talks to a thousand girls and he's yeah, insecure that too that too He's for the streets. He's for the streets. If he's for the streets. But what's the biggest green flag in a guy, though? Um, if he loves his mom. Yes, good relationship with their mom. That's good. If he gives too many girls attention, I don't want your attention if anyone can have it. Oh, I have a whole ick wall, so this is a good question. Give me a good list. Oh, okay. Well, I think, like, bigger butt than me is a big one. Um, that's an ick. Yeah, that's an ick. I thought that's a green flag. No, that's not. Um, oh, if they played in the comment game. That's a good one. Um, oh, Let's see, what else? Kaylee, what do you got? X. Ah, uh, like when they run? Wait, let me refer to Oh. Like Cross country oh, runners? Know, several. Ankle socks. Oh, big one. Um, yes, like, that was They just like, like sprint places. Like running when you, sh like with running not- She has a whole list she's pulling up I'm right now. I'm pulling it up, hold on, give me one second here. Buzz cut. I used to have a buzz cut. Yeah, it's like for red. Yeah. I think it, it tests the personality, you know, like. Yeah. Sure, I just. It's character building. It definitely is character building because most people look ugly with it. But some pull it off. Some pull it off for sure. Like ginger, uh, hiccups in their sleep. Um, let's see. Uh, These are pants. good. They wear pink pants. Like who who does that? Um, they go. They went to UCC. <laughs> this, I'm looking at the chart right now. It's color coded, yep. alphabetical order, uh, organized. Said AF in conversation. Says FURTA. Um, Plays volleyball, Android that phone. Oh, so not an ick. That is so not an ick. That's awesome. Harry butt. <laughs> um, uses bath bombs. But 
What? Okay. Oh, oh, oh. Couldn't disassemble an IKEA bed. I, I agree with that one. When they wear a muscle tee everywhere they go, that's the biggest ick. Like tight on the chest, tight on the shoulders. Yeah, like, when they go to parties and stuff, they have to wear a muscle tee. When they're going grocery shopping, muscle tee, just everywhere muscle tee, I hate it. So what's the go-to party fit? Like what's like a good fit for a guy? Denim jeans and just a basic t-shirt. What's the best first date idea? Um, dinner or not a walk on the beach. Anything but that. Anything but the beach. Yeah. Formal dinner or like casual picnic wine? Sandwiches. Like a formal, like a nice restaurant. Nice dinner, yeah. If he ties you up, puts you in back of his car, and then takes you on a joyride. I think that's the most creative, creative answer we we had. Thank Wait, what, what do you do on the drive then? Um, I. Where is he taking you? Uh, to the water park. Take her swimming on the first, first day. Yep. Yeah, I beat you to it. The pier. <laughs> the pier. Take her swimming. Yeah. Take her swimming and then like a nice like cute little dinner. S some sushi and wine. Yeah. Picnic by the sunset and stars. Yes. Sunset for sure. Stars. Best first date? Yes. Oh, uh, go for a drive. Good vibes. Very chill. I don't want you to take me out for dinner. That's gross. Sunset and watching yeah. the stars. Yeah, just hanging out. I don't like to go on dates. <laughs> what do you like to do? Um, not go on dates. Okay, fair enough. And where on Queen's campus would you find your future wife? At the library, because, you know, you need a nice, smart lady to accompany and create a good family with. 9 a.m. On a, on a Saturday at the Harry Potter room in the library. Exactly. Great guy right here. I love this guy. He's a great and where can you find your future husband here on Queen's campus? The Ark. The Ark. The Ark. Uh, fuck. Nowhere. <laughs> Nowhere. Nowhere. Not even like in the library? No. In the gym? Uh, definitely not. <laughs> so gym, gym guys are douchebags? Depend if you refer to yourself as a gym bro, yes. If you refer to yourself as an alpha male, yes. However, if you simply work out because it's good for you and you don't flaunt it for the world to see, good for you. That, that's great. I, I agree. I agree. And pr probably the men's change room of the arc. Some athletic field. Yeah. One of the fields. One of the fields. Mix and Tyndall. Yeah. Oh, uh, the pier. The pier. Yeah, the pier. Are, are you scouting future prospects right now? Yes. <laughs> Nowhere. Not on Queens. Not campus. on Queens. That's Queens true. guys aren't aren't it. No, no. They're not it. What about like Laurier? Maybe Western. Saint Lawrence. Saint Lawrence. Um, nowhere because every Queens man is a SLUT slut. Okay, where are you, you gonna find your future husband? Um, church. Oh. Uh, <laughs> you first. Uh, Smith School of Business. Um, ILC. <laughs> like the end building. Oh, okay, okay. And what's one word of advice you have for the people watching today? for your exams. Study for your exams. Enjoy the weather. Don't be too stressed about exams. Like, you're going to do well anyways. You're all smart. School's optional right now. Um, honestly, I don't back that. Stay in school. Do well. But, like, enjoy life and, like, enjoy the people around you. Mine's not that deep, but for all the ladies out there, sun's out, buns out. Don't, don't date guys at Queens. Slam some brews and fuck some dudes. Go for a swim. <laughs> Jump in the pier. Go to the pier. Yeah. Study hard and do good on your exams. Honestly, men are full of X. They're not worth it. So it's better to be like a, a nun or a lesbian. Yes, be a nun. I'm, I'm taking all my nun. One piece of advice for the people watching. She said, Ginger, um, piece of advice. I would say, um, like, it's kind of cringy, but just do it for the plot. It's better to be called crazy than to be called boring. Cheers. I love it. Uh, we're at the pier now. We got the entire squad. We're all going to jump in. I know I said I was going to jump in my Speedos, um, but they're too small or my cock just grew. Um, and also, but we got these nice, nice shorts. Um, and yeah, maybe we're going to do like a silly salmon, maybe like a, a swan dive, maybe like a cannonball head first. So I don't know. Um, but thank you for 500 subscribers. The water's cold as balls. I jumped in yesterday. My ball's just negative, like negative length. They shriveled in. Uh, it was the coldest part, like the ball. Uh, we're gonna jump in now. Yeah! This is for 500 subscribers. Thank you. Let's go. Ah! Ah! All right, post jump thoughts. 
Um, it's amazing. It's a beautiful day. The water is nice and cold. You feel refreshed. 500 subscribers. Everyone's feeling good. We're just studying right now for exams and listening to uh, Lana Del Rey. Um, and I think uh, feminine products, hygiene products, should be free. Uh, six three, by the way. <laughs> Subscribe for a free date with my sister. She swallows. <laughs> Got the cameras. Subscribe if you want to pass your finals. <laughs> Subscribe for a tan. <laughs> Subscribe if you want to pull single moms. Yes, subscribe for single moms. <laughs> subscribe for single moms. Subscribe, subscribe for, for single dads too. If you go with Dilf and Milf activity, subscribe. <laughs> they'll come subscribe to subscribe if you're a nerd of these girls. Okay. That's gonna wrap up the video. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, check out my Instagram, TikTok, Snapchat, uh, and subscribe if you want to see a video uh, in a hot tub with all of them. <laughs> Thank you for watching.